Hello, I'm in the midst of moving house and I thought I'd share a couple of tips I've come across whilst doing it for packing up stuff. First one is this has had this stuff. Get yourself some old inner tubes from a bicycle shop. I'm sure they'll have lots of throwing away or recycling. Cut it into strips and if you've got a box like this one here, then you can put something flat on the top. When I say a box like this one here, something with an open top. You don't want stuff falling out, obviously, or collapsing into the box. So put something flat on the top that you want to pack. Use your um, giant elastic band that you've just made at the strip of of this stuff and strap it around. Second tip, this one's even better. Get yourself some um, self-adhesive wallpaper. Now I'm using this because I bought it by mistake. Um, I thought it'd be the, the thing to, to um, wallpaper this room but it turned out that it's somewhat see-through when you put it on the walls. I need to use up for something. I had the great idea of using it for labels. You can cut it easily, you can write on it with biro or um, sharpie or something, permanent marker, and you can tear it too, so you can sort of rip it down to size without looking for um, scissors or anything. And the great thing is it'll fit on bent surfaces, it'll stick to most things, it's sticking here to the the side of the um, this mesh that's working, sticking to this wood. It's sort of working on the curved surface here. Down here it's sticking on the corner, the plastic, it's sticking on this sort of cloth <laughs> cloth surface. It sticks to anything and it's it stayed stuck for a good week or more. And I don't think it's gonna fall off too easily when the things are being moved. And the great thing is, if you've ever moved house, I mean, very big house here, uh, it's just so tempting just to scroll on the box in a pen, and like as not, you're going to be using some second-hand boxes that have had other things scrawled on them. And when it comes to actually unpacking them, it'll have, you know, kitchen, bedroom two, bedroom one, bathroom, all crossed out and scribbled over, and you're not going to be sure which one is the right label. So having consistent white labels with the same wallpaper will help you know and also help your house moving people know if you're getting people in to do it for you it'll let them know which label to actually take notice of so i hope those two tips help you with your house move happy moving